What's up dimes and gems? Welcome back to my YouTube channel and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys all of my favorite natural hair care products. So I'm going to be showing you guys my huge natural hair care product stash i have a lot of products it's 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 a problem it's an issue i think i have a problem i have so many products in here i got so many shampoos all in front of me right now is my shampoos then i got conditioners leave-ins creams deep conditioners edge controls gels all types of stuff oh my god it's so much but it's okay you guys wanted to see it that's what you guys voted on instagram make sure you follow me Diamond is on here. I'll make sure I have that in the description box. But make sure you follow me on Instagram. This is what you guys wanted to see. You guys wanted to see all, I can't get it, all of my products. Oh my God. This is so much. And this is this hat. You guys wanted to see all of it. So I'm going to show it to you. Um, these are the products that make my curls pop make my hair smell good and keeping my curls nice and healthy and juicy and all of that good stuff um make sure you guys subscribe to my channel i'm gonna, I'm gonna wait a few seconds all right you should be subscribed without further ado we're gonna go ahead and get into this video so let's get it let's get it Let's get it, let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. Hey. All right, so let's get into it. Okay, so the first thing that I have here is the Cream of Nature Clay and Charcoal Pre Shampoo Detoxifying, Detoxifying, Detoxifying Clay Mask. So this is what it looks like. And then also, this is a shampoo. So I'm gonna show you guys all the shampoos first. Um, I don't think I'm gonna really sit here and explain what they all do, but that's gonna be a long video. I'm just showing you guys what I what I got in my stash, and I'll give you like a little uh, I guess explanation of what they do, just a small one. So this is a charcoal collection, um, and it helps detoxify by removing buildup. Um, it softens your hair. It's for all hair types, um, and it cleanses and it tints deep moisture for your curls um like it says provides touchable softness removes buildup and it controls frizz i think i said that twice i really like this shampoo the pre-shampoo it comes in handy especially when i know that i'm gonna either get my hair blown out i use this or when i feel like my curls just need some extra love this comes in handy or when i take my braids out i'm probably gonna use this um, it really works. It's great. I like it. It leaves my curls feeling great. And I believe I can detangle with this. I can't remember. And it also has apple cider vinegar, which is really good. So if you ever did a regular clay mask with apple cider vinegar and the Aztec clay, it's really good. So, yeah. Moving on to the Soft and Moisture Replenish Shampoo. So as soon as you use the pre-shampoo, you go right in with the shampoo. Um, it's the same thing as the pre-shampoo. It makes your hair soft. It takes those impurities and build up out of your hair and leaves your hair feeling really squeaky clean and it does not strip your hair, which I really enjoy. So I'm gonna move on to Shade Moisture. So I have Shade Moisture's Coconut and Hibiscus Curl and Shine Shampoo. And then I have the Shea Moisture Manuka Honey and Mephora Oil Intensive Hydration Shampoo. Who that title was made long. So with both of these shampoos, I like using them because this one is just moisture and defines for thick and curly hair. And then this one is for hydration and replenish for dry damage hair. So I use this one the most because I have really dry hair and dry scalp. So this helps with adding hydration to my curls and keeping them moisturized. And 
I really like this too because it adds some shine to my hair and it keeps it smelling good. So that's all I can say about this one. I don't really use this one often. I do need to use this again. But I like Shea Moisture, period. It don't matter what it is. My hair likes Shea Moisture a lot. So we're gonna move on. Um, I know I shouldn't say this product, this whole collection, this whole company, because a lot of people are uh, canceling out Miel. Um, I don't really know what happened with Miel and why people are canceling them. So hopefully no one cancels me. But I really like Miel. My favorite line is the pomegranate and honey line. I haven't tried anything else from them. Um, I do want to try like the ginger line. I think that's what it's called. Honey, Hawaiian ginger, something like that. I'm going to get my hands on that. But my favorite line is the pomegranate and honey moisturizer and detangling shampoo i think this is probably the first product that i tried when i actually did go natural so this is actually for more so type 4 hair but it doesn't that doesn't mean if you're type 3 you can't use it on type 2 so i use it on my type 3 hair and it works perfectly fine i like it it smells amazing oh it's like heaven in a bottle and it leaves my curls smelling good and I can detangle with it and I love it. So we're gonna move on. I believe that is all my shampoos because I don't have a lot of shampoos. I have these two little shampoos by OGX. One is the coconut milk shampoo and then one is the argan oil shampoo. I don't really use these, but they're in my stash just in case one day I may be traveling somewhere and I need some shampoo, I can take these with me. Or I see if I ran out of shampoo, these come in handy. So we're just gonna move on from there. Yeah, we're gonna move on to conditioners and leave-ins. That's gonna take forever because I have a lot of those. So let's do that. All right, so I might have to take my glasses off because I can't, I can't do it with this glare. So, let's get into leave-ins and conditioners so sorry guys back with the BL. oh my gosh so this is the pomegranate and honey moisturizing and detangling conditioner which deeply hydrates conditions and silk and stick curly type 4 hair like i said before you don't have to only use this if you're type 4 if you're type 3 it will still work trust me it works wonders I actually have not used the conditioner in a long time um, yeah I haven't I only I only use I only use the um, leave-in and the shampoo um, if I if I do use the conditioner it might be because my hair might need some extra TLC some extra love but I haven't used this in a minute Just so on to the leave-in so this is the Miel pomegranate in Pomegranate and honey leave-in conditioner, which is moisturizing, curl primer, and detangling for thick, curly type 4 hair. Like I said again, you can use this if you're type 3. Um, I don't know if you can use this if you're type 2. I'm not too sure. But what I like about the leave-in is that it pairs with a lot of my stylers that I use, which is awesome because you don't want to use a leave-in and a styler that don't work your curls. Whatever hairstyle you do, it's gonna be flaking, baby. It's gonna be let it snow, let it snow. You don't want that, no, no, no. So you gotta make sure you find a good leave-in that pairs well with all your stylers and your gels, and this is one of them. That pretty much, um, pretty much pairs very, very well with all of it. Um, I love it. I just gotta smell it. It smells so good. This is actually a new bottle. I have another bottle, but it's probably empty. <laughs> Because me and my mom are both natural now, and this is probably the only leave-in that I use. Besides this one, I started using this. This is Aunt Jackie's Curls and Coils Quench Moisture Intensive Leave-In Conditioner. Um, so I really like this because especially if you need a lot of moisture, if you have dry curls like me, this is your friend. Man, it's ultra hydrating, deep moisture therapy for parched tresses. So this is really good, and it smells good too. I like um, Aunt Jackie's products. I just started using them, and my curls be popping, popping, popping. 
pa ben were on jackets. So I like on jackets. Y'all gotta get on jackets stuff. It's really good. And it has shea moisture and olive oil. My hair loves. I said shea moisture. Oh, they just heard it. This has shea butter and olive oil. My hair likes shea butter a lot. Okay, so we got another Trey Lux. So this is the Untie the Knot Nourishing, nourishing Leave-In Conditioner. This is for wavy, coily, and curly hair. Um, this detangles, nourishes, and replenishes moisture for lively curls. This, this, like, this reminds me of, this smells like Christmas. Like y'all know those like cinnamon Christmas cookies or something? That's what it smells like, like, like cinnamon cookies. Peppermint, not peppermint, it smells like cinnamon. This is really good um, leave-in conditioner, but you kind of got to use it within the line. So like all the Trelux products that it comes with it, you kind of got to use it to pair it with it correctly. Because I don't think this pairs well with other products from what I'm remembering. But I really do like this. This is a more so thicker leave-in. This is a more so of a watery base leave-in. Yeah. The Aunt Jackie's one is a little more based okay I'm just making sure nothing fell let's see oh we got the shea moisture on um, the Manuka honey line and then the coconut and hibiscus line I do need to go back to the store and get the big bottle because it's literally nothing in here because me and my mom use this up um it's a lot in here like I said before I don't really use the coconut and hibiscus line, but I do use it in a pinch if I want to. So that is all for leave-ins and conditioners. So I guess we can just go ahead and show off deep conditioners. So this is an empties, almost dropped it. This is Miel's Babasu and Mint Deep Conditioner. I really like this stuff, y'all. I'm so sad it's only eight um, fluid ounces. I really wish it was a bigger container. Like this one, this is 12 ounces. Um, it smells so good. There's literally nothing left in here. It's a protein treatment. And I really like using this because this comes in handy like if I'm about to get a blown out, a blowout and I need my hair to be a little strong, has some, has some strength to it, this comes in handy. Um, this is my go-to deep conditioner. I just really like this. It's a hair mask. And it's a hydration mask. And like I said, hydration and anything with hydration works with my clothes because I have a dry skin. So, what can we do next? We can do gels. On to the next one. All right, so this is the last of it. So, I have right here. Oh, it's almost gone. This is melanin um twist and elongating style cream by melanin hair care this is by whitney natural 85 she is awesome on youtube her hair is so pretty um i love this stuff i haven't used it in a while but it's really good guys i use this for wash and goes I think I used it for a braid out. I think I used it for a twist out. And it never steers me wrong. It is a little on the pricey side. I cannot remember how much this is. I think it's 20. But like between 16 and 20 dollars. But it's worth it. Like when you get it, it's full to the top. And it, it's, it's gonna take a minute to you know go through it, especially if you don't use it every day. I don't use this every day. So I would say it's August. I would say by December, I would probably be done this. But I had this for a while, and this is one of my go-to's. This is one of my holy grails for when I need to I pop in wash and go. So this is Trey Lux Curl Supreme Form 1 Hydrating Cream, which hydrates, strengthens, protects, and styles. So this is one cream that I like that I don't have to use like a gel or anything. You can literally use the whole Trey Lux collection, which is the is this so you use the the rinse first then you go in with the leave-in and then you literally go in with this and you're only using one product i did a wash and go with this it was pretty good a lot of definition no parabens no silicone sulfates or artificial color um it smells really good 
as you can see I literally have it all the way to the top because I only used it once um, and I might use it sometimes to what is it refresh my curls I like it um, if, if you're looking for a styler where you only need one product to do your hair this is what it is this is it and it's a four-in-one hygiene hydrating cream I can't talk like throughout this whole video like it's sounding crazy um, it's a 4-in-1 hydrating cream, so this is really good. I really like this one. This, I haven't used this all the way yet, but I've been using this to like refresh my curls. So this is Curls Unleashed Coconut and Avocado Does It All Smoothie Styler. It's, oh, it smells so good. I don't know anybody else, but I love coconut. And this smells really good. I want to use this, I want to try this out for... Oh, you use fingers to form coils, waves, twist out the texture snaps. So I might try a twist out with this um, to see what I get. But I use this just in my regular curls. Like some days when I have my wash and goes and I add a little bit of water to refresh my curls, my curls be popping. So ORS, this is one of my favorite to use. Another ORS product, which is the Shea Butter and Honey Curl Defining Cream. I haven't used this yet at all literally like it's still full to the top so i can't say anything about that oh i forgot about their leave-in cream this is curls unleashed coconut and shea butter leave and conditioner cream i don't know why i couldn't say that i only used this a few times it's pretty okay i like it i'm not too crazy about the smell it's a little too strong for me but it it works it works um only use this once this is blueberries bliss blueberry bliss twist and shout cream so it adds sheen moisture and definition and creates a perfect twist and braid out i actually did a twist out with this um in one of my videos i don't know i did i think it was i don't think it was this um it was the curls unleashed color blast um, hair wax, but I can't remember what style it was. I think I did a twist out with this, and then I took my twist out and then added the, the hair wax color on top. This twist cream is the bomb. So, um, from just what I did that one time, I really like this. It doesn't have no sulf it has no sulfate, silicones, parabens, no artificial oils, colors, or fragrances. It just smells like blueberries. It smells so good. I really like this. I'm gonna have to use this again as a um, and it's so soft. Use this again for another um, twist out because it works really good. I really like this, guys. So I think that's it. Besides edge control, so we got the 24-hour edge chamber by Eben. That's empty, and then we got the lot of body control me edge gel and then cream and egg shirt with argan oil from morocco perfect edges edge control that's all i use i mainly use this one but right now i have this on my edges because this is what i saw first i think that is everything guys it is everything i don't know if this video was very boring or it was funny or educational i don't know uh, hopefully it was funny and made you laugh um i'm not too sure I just was being myself. <laughs> that's all I can be. That's all I can do. All right, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Thank you for sitting down and actually listening to me ramble on about all my natural hair care products and my favorite hair care products that I love to use and my curls to make my curls pop. Like I said, please make sure that you subscribe. I'm going to stop again. Please, you tell your friends and then tell your friends to tell their friends. And then their friends are going to tell their friends to tell their friends to tell my friends to tell your friends to subscribe. That's all you got to do. You just got to hit that button, subscribe, and hit the bell so you don't miss my new upload. I like vlogs and you guys like vlogs. So I'm going to give you guys what you want and what you love. So without further ado, make sure you subscribe to my channel, hit that notification bell, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! Detectifying. Detectifying.
My favorite line is the pomegranate and honey line. Pomegranate. Pomegranate. And it's a four in one hygiene. Hi. Drain cream. Shea butter, lave, and conditioner cream. Yes, dancing. Hey, peep dancing.